a meditation for people who want to break toxic cycles in their families. For many folks, when you set out to break the cycle of trauma you experienced, you might discover that on certain days, you are at the edge of becoming the very monster that hurt you. In the moments when you are stressed, overwhelmed, or re-triggered, it is right at your heels. There is a pull, which can be small, almost imperceptible at times, to repeat the very behaviors and tendencies that were displayed in the person that hurt you. Addiction, blame, control, violence, and more. Victims can become perpetrators. Maybe all perpetrators were once victims. And so if you see this potential in yourself, it doesn't make you broken or unhealed or even unique. It means you're aware of the family shadow and how you have inherited it in your way too. Thankfully, to be aware and to worry that you might pass it on is a sign you will be less likely to do so. But it doesn't mean you don't have work to do. To hold the intention to do things differently means having good and bad days, finding the right support, having tough conversations, apologizing for wrongdoing, and learning very deeply you are worthy of something more. Facing the monster within you is part of how we break the cycle, and it's often a major paradigm shift in our family tree. It can be an interruption of a pattern that was hundreds of years in the making. All potentials live within us. What we do with that makes all the difference.